looking at this uh, article first, uh, M1 Ultra Benchmarks posted, and they compare it to the uh, Ryzen um, Threadripper, which has a multi 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 thread score of twenty five thousand over twenty five thousand, but this is a sixty four core. Um, uh, CPU. So if we look at the the single core performance and the multi core performance of the M1 Ultra, and we compare it with the M1 Max, we see that they have similar. This is neg ne negligible data, but performance per core is also very similar. It's within it drops uh, in multi core it drops a 70% you know it drops 30% actually but it's 70% uh, the performance of single but in uh, ultra it's only 67 while in the the thread reaper the performance between single and multi core goes down to 32 which is absolutely crazy you know the more the more cores the less performance you're going to have but even you know intel's um i9 16 to 10 cores there's a huge drop this is a 63 percent of the power so you're dropping actually like a 47 percent and uh, it's always half with 16 cores well, this is only 30% and this is only 33%. That means there is room. Yes, there might be room for M1 Ultra Pro because you could actually have a lot more cores before you get to an acceptable like 60% or, or even 54%. You could have 40 cores. That would be very, very, very interesting. 